half of the circuit dry, half of it still wet. They're away. Tire choice is going to be important, as Reggie's just told us. Harrington. Harrington through first. We're watching a changing of the guard here. Two young guys, the 25... Jimmy Stone is best known for being one half of the hugely successful Stone Brothers racing V8 supercar operation he ran with his brother Ross. Before he and Ross set up and ran Alan Jones Racing, and before Jimmy worked for Dick Johnson Racing, and before he built and engineered several Group A cars in the late 1980s and early 90s, and before he designed and built his own brand of Cuda single seaters, before he designed and built Jack Naser's Chevy V8 powered Vauxhall Victor which won the New Zealand Saloon Car Championship in 1976 and 77, he built and raced this beautiful little Mark 1 Escort twin cam. Only it didn't look like this, it looked like this. And this car is quite special because even though Jimmy spent a lifetime in racing, he didn't actually do a lot of driving. He usually built cars for other people to drive. But this little Escort he actually designed and built for himself to race. The other cool thing about this car was that he built a special small bore Lotus twin cam engine for it so he could run it in the 1300cc saloon car class. And Jimmy's 1300cc twin cam revved to 10,000 RPM. After campaigning the Escort for a couple of seasons it was put away in the shed until it was purchased several years later by Roy Harrington to contest the 2 litre Shell Sport Championship. Harrington totally rebuilt the Escort for the Shell Sport regulations. It sprouted huge front and rear spoilers, it underwent a massive weight loss program, and a new 1600cc Lotus twin cam engine was built, which was moved back in the chassis a full 12 inches. It was then decked out in the bright yellow Auto Trader colours as you see here, and then Harrington went on to win the Shell Sport Championship in both 1982 and 83. Look at the start as they go up. Reg obviously has a problem, a little slow there. Try to get it going now. Find out a little later on what the problem was. Looking as they scream up there, Mark Rutherford has got an excellent start up from the second row of the group. Let them sort themselves out, they'll pick it up. As they get around there, Reg Cook, quite slow at the start. It's Tony Marsh. The man leading out, Mark Rutherford behind him. Tony Marsh, Rutherford. Days, the Jimmy Stone Roy Harrington Escort Twin Cam is owned by David Thompson. It's a true survivor, restored back to the Harrington Shell Sport guys. And it's no show pony, it's still given a regular flogging. 
Anyway, thanks for watching guys. Hope you enjoyed this little video. Hope you learned a little something here. Um, please like and uh, while you're at it, hit the subscribe button. Catch you next time. Cheers. Marsh. Give it back to Barra up in second place.